Welcome to the American Folklife Center's Homegrown at Home Concert Series 2021. We're Vri from Wales, and it's our absolute pleasure to be performing for you today. The American Folklife Center will release a concert every other Wednesday from now through September 22nd at noon East Coast US time. And each artist will be there with you in the chat section to answer questions, so be sure to say hi. After each concert is released, you can continue to find the video on the library's website or YouTube channel. Good afternoon and welcome to Wales, specifically the Tabernacle Chapel here in Cumavan in the beautiful Avan Valley. For those of you who are not aware of Wales, we are a small but very beautiful country nestling next to England in the British Isles. If you are aware of us, then you'll probably know that we are the land of song or Gwadagan, and it's largely thanks to places like this, the Methodist Chapel, that we have such a rich tradition of hymn singing. As well as a fantastic hymn book, we also have a very rich repertoire of traditional folk music, which was largely ignored and forgotten during the 20th century, uh, and is now, I'm pleased to say, making a fantastic revival. Uh, I'm Patrick Grimes, and along with Anirin Jones and Jordan Price Williams from this very village, uh, we are Vri, and it's our mission in life to, uh, as well as relishing the hymns, uh, to really bring that traditional folk music back to the prominence. Thank you. 
thank you for joining us here in Tabernacle Chapel in Carmarthen. And rather appropriately so, we started our set there with um, an old Welsh hymn tune um, that was of a traditional origin called Dewch Ir Vrydir. And we, um, we followed on then with a tune I wrote for my dog, who's called Q, who is um, a spaniel. And Q means chick in Welsh. We've been very lucky to um, use this incredible space here today, which is um, the chapel that I was actually um, baptised in, as was my father and my grandfather. Um, and so we're going to honour this by uh, playing a really popular um, and very beautiful Welsh traditional hymn tune called Krieg y Bar. As we've already alluded to, the tradition of chapel singing is one of the jewels in Wales' musical crown. But while these hymns were being sung to the rafters during the Reformation, our traditional dance music wasn't faring too well, as it was cast aside as an instrument of sin. Fiddles were hastily hidden in the ceilings, harps buried under floorboards in the kitchen, and this traditional music all but died out. We owe a huge debt of thanks to the Romany Gypsy population in Wales, who didn't much care what society thought of them. And thank goodness for that, because they single-handedly preserved this fantastic repertoire of tunes. And they didn't half like to dance.
ago, my father, Tim Williams, was a soldier in the Watton, Brecon's 18th century army barracks. 200 years before him, another Tim Williams in the same barracks was writing this farewell ballad on the departure of the 23rd Regiment from the town of Brecon to the island of Guernsey. In it, he talks about the beauty of the land and the virtues of the people of the town and how the soldiers are leaving to fight and to be buried in a foreign land. Thank you. 
Well, sadly, we've come to the end of our performance today, but we just want to say a massive thank you, or diolch yn fawr, as we say in Wales, to Thea Austin and everybody at the Library of Congress for having us. We've really enjoyed putting this concert together and it's been a massive honour. Hopefully soon, in the near future, we could uh, come and play in person for you. And also a massive thank you to Maidwen Crockett, who provided this chapel, the Tabernacle, in Cumavan, Wales, for us this afternoon. We're now going to finish off with a very popular slow Welsh tune. Um, it almost became the melody for our national anthem. It's called Glan Method Moy, which translates as good humoured and drunk, which could have been a very appropriate uh, name for our national anthem. We hope, really hope you enjoy it and Diochen Vaureto. Thank you. <laughs>